time for another vlog i am trying to be really good over on this app website whatever you want to call it so hope you guys are appreciating all the new content i think just because i'm able to travel again now and i've got a few travel vlogs and stuff going on I kind of am a bit more motivated, but I'm being really conscious as well because I know a lot of you have said that you really just like chilled at home vlogs, me chatting, that kind of shit. So that's what I'm doing. Sometimes to me, it seems boring. I'm like, well, you know, I'm just shooting or I'm just cleaning at home or doing that kind of thing. But I seem to get really good feedback from you guys. And I was actually talking to a girl on Instagram. She'd replied to a lot of my stories and I saw one of them and I was like, oh my God. So I quickly tried to reply back. Um, and she just basically said that she really, really likes the vlogs where I just sit down and chill and chat and talk. So that's what we're trying to do. I am doing a bit of shooting this morning. I am just getting like some stories and stuff. I am just catching up on some things. I have some meetings. I feel like I'm always saying that I'm like, overwhelmed with work but i don't know what it is this year is just going so quickly like it's just crazy it's just always one thing after the other but that's right i love my job i love my work i love my life i have to unbox some parcels i'm gonna head to the warehouse for a bit actually as well i need to do a few things in there speaking of the year going fast so the girls and i decided that we were going to go on a melbourne trip <sighs> honestly probably like six months ago. And I remember thinking, let's just not book for ages because that's a little bit dramatic. Like we wanted to go in winter when it was nice and cold, cool Melbourne trip, you know, rug up and wear winter clothes, that kind of thing. And now it's literally a matter of days away. And I'm just like, how the hell did the year go so quickly? I wasn't going to vlog the trip. And then I just decided you guys have been liking the travel content. So I think I might just do like a girl's weekend vlog which should be nice. So I might show you guys where we eat and whatever. Basically, we're just going down there to eat, uh, do a little bit of shopping, get a couple of pics, have a couple of drinks, and yeah, that's it. Okay, there is a little bit going on here. So these are the parcels, some of the ones that I got while I was away. I do need to go downstairs though because I do have another few parcels to collect. So I'll get those unboxed today. I also, that very large parcel, I completely forgot that that was arriving when I'm away. It is actually a mattress, which is really exciting. It's quite a heavy mattress. I haven't even told you guys, but Emily, who lives in my apartment, my roomie. She is actually moving out in July. She bought an apartment off the plan a couple of years ago, uh, probably like two years ago, I would say. She actually, originally when we moved in together, we thought that she was only gonna be with me here for a lot less than what she has. So I'm so glad that her builders and her site has been like super delayed. So she's been able to stay with me a lot longer here. So her bedroom is going to become a spare bedroom. At this stage, I'm not 100% sure what's gonna happen, whether a desk will go in there or what. Haven't really decided on what's gonna go in there, but for now, I'm gonna set it up as a spare bedroom and hasn't moved out yet she's not moving out for a little while but i'm going to put the mattress out and see how it goes and kind of get it set up for what it'll be like when she does leave so excited to feel what these mattresses actually feel like because i have heard so many good things about them oh that was so tricky solo oh my god so right now I'm currently in M's room. She is still living in here right now, but this is gonna be a spare bedroom when she leaves. So she's getting a new mattress right now. I really like the end gold like uh, coffee table that we have out that way and it matches in with these bedside tables. So I feel that they're gonna be the same bedside tables that I keep here when M leaves. I think they're so cute and I love them. They're like a travertine. Um, I think it's travertine, I believe it's called. But anyway, I'm gonna open this mattress. It was very difficult getting it to this point and getting rid of M's old mattress. Lucky her, she's getting a brand new mattress for the rest of the time that she's staying here. And then, um, yeah, this will be the spare bed mattress. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it. If you guys have seen these mattresses open up before, they sort of just like pop out. So I'm hoping I don't knock myself out or 
I don't know, do something crazy here. So the mattress that I have chosen for this my bedroom is the Emma Sleep Comfort mattress. So it's a memory foam one. So it has the motion stabilization and the temperature regulation and all of that. I'm very fussy when it comes to mattresses, so I'm super keen to get this one open. I think I'm going to go have to get some scissors. Hold that thought. Just for my own bed, but I'm kind of jealous now. Oh. I see what they mean by like the memory stabilization. Like I could be bouncing here, and you're not gonna feel it here. I'm so impressed, with these guys. I'm gonna show you what it looks like when it's back on, and I'll show you how it will be styled once it's a spare. Bedroom just with like a white plane, just super simple white and plain, just like you know how I like it. That's what will happen. And then the only thing I would need to do would be to get some stuff for the bedside tables. I don't know if I get <clears throat> maybe like a coffee book on one side or I don't know. Emma Sleep was kind enough to give me a discount code, so I'll chuck that on the screen for you guys. But it is Talia 5 and it gives you 5% off. They do have a big sale on at the moment, so my code will give you an additional 5% off that sale as well but i think that sale is only running for a couple of weeks so make sure you're getting quick and there we go that is the bed i really need to fix this doona cover situation up but that's probably what i'm gonna do just something like that i love heaps of pillows i don't know what pillows but i have some spare boucle ones so yeah i'm gonna chuck some of those on and then this is just a linen doona cover i should probably Iron that. I will keep you guys updated on when Em actually moves out. If I ever film a haul of my place, I will let you guys know how I finish styling it. Like I said, I need to put some stuff on the bedside tables here. I think I do want to keep these bedside tables here. Probably change the pillows up slightly, but yeah, that is a start. Like I said, I have a 5% discount code for my Emma Sleep mattress. They have their International Day of Families promo on at the moment, but my discount code will give you guys an extra 5% off if you did want to make a little saving, if you were sprucing up your spare bedroom like me, or if you are just needing a full makeover for your bedroom. So, I'm trying to try and prop you guys. Um, you're not very high up. Oh, can I put them on this? I'll put you on this box. Hi! Hi, hi, hi! So, Charles and I, uh, we've been shooting, hence all the makeup. That went, we actually did pretty good, hey? Yeah, we smashed that Banged out. Banged it out pretty quickly before the sun kind of went down. And then we are doing some skein stuff. I'm on both of my phones doing that. I don't know if I spoke to you guys about before, but I need to set this phone up. Um, but these are some of the piggies we got when we were just out. I need to set up this phone properly because I've done the switcheroonie. I don't actually can't remember if I said it before, but yeah, I changed phones because the other one was super filled up and I just figured that I really need to get a new iCloud because it takes so long to delete stuff and it just gets so full. Obviously when it's your job to take photos, it fills up so quickly and that many times I've said I'm trying to delete stuff, hey, and it just, mm -hmm. and then I go take another couple thousand bloody photos and then it goes back up again so it's time it's a bit of a nightmare so what i did was i got a new phone this is the i actually got this before 
America, which is ridiculous. And I hadn't set it up until I was in Bali just because I was going to try and delete as much as I could on the other phone and transfer it all over. But I've started fresh with this one here. I have a new iCloud now. All my messages won't be on there. That's probably the only thing that kind of I hate. Mm. Okay. Not that I need them, but I sort of do, like, if I need to go back for stuff. Yes. But there's definitely going to be a transition period of both of these phones. So for a couple of months, I'm going to be having two phones again. And then I'll fully do the Switch Rooney. But, yeah, this phone's the two terabyte one. So hopefully that should be okay. Yeah, it's confusing. It's all confusing. Any iCloud phone stuff <laughs> is just all very confusing. Anyway, moral story is I have a new phone. But we're saying I'm doing some skein stuff, planning the feed. Um, and getting a few things sorted for the week. Charles is unboxing all of these parcels. Ow. Unboxing all the parcels for me. And then we have some PM photos to get tonight as well. It's actually one of these. I'm getting a poly photo tonight, which is about to come. Um, and a few others. But we're going to go to dinner because it was Charles' birthday <laughs> yesterday. Yay. So we're going to go to dinner. We're going to go to Jamelli's. We tried to get a table, but they didn't have one. So we're just going to do a walk in and see how we go. Surely. 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 Come on. You think so. I belong, I belong to you. I belong, I belong to you. So I've moved to the couch now and look at the sunset. I think I bought the good weather back with me from Bali because everyone whinged the whole time about the weather and now it's actually really nice. That looks like winter out there, doesn't it? You know, it's just like, yeah, like it wasn't today. It's warm and it's been like a really warm week, but you know how we just get nice sunsets in winter. Like I feel like that's the first start and it might be on its way. I'm about to start editing a vlog on here. It is, what time is it? It is 1.07 p.m. Lol, you can see my Uber Eats <laughs> that I just got. I just got a Cali burrito from Uber Eats because I just really need to get so much work done today. And I know that's so lazy of me because it's Saturday and I should probably be going out. Like, look at the weather as well, by the way. Oh, it's just so nice out there. I really should be back out walking or doing something but i just really need to get my work done because i get so stressed and overwhelmed come monday if i'm not feeling ready and the past like three weeks i have not been ready for mondays just because i've been away and stuff so this monday i'm gonna feel good okay guys so much active wear turned up so i might just give you a little run through because we all love active wear this is new white fox active that is adorable 
I'm so into that. They've done amazing. As usual, Talia XO is my discount code. I got some stacks. I freaking love that color. That is so nice. It's like a really nice sage. The material is super soft. It's like even more soft and buttery than what it used to be, like the best black tights. So I'm really, really loving stacks at the moment. Always have, but I really like this new material that they're using. Uh, Talia 10 is my discount code for that one. This is, I don't know this brand, but they sent it to me. Do Talia, I'm gonna be like, oh, that's so sweet. Ace Active, I think you say. Cute as, so this is like a thicker, um, it's kind of like a seamless sort of material. It feels really, really nice. And then they've sent me some booty bands as well. And then we have some Susky. I'm really excited to try this stuff, guys. Like, super, super excited. I've worn Sasuke so many times over the years, but I haven't tried any of their new stuff for a little while. So, I'm going to lay all of these bits and pieces out. Cute. You can tell that I love my neutrals and my browns. Love these shades. I did also get this really pretty bright blue color. And then that is a sweater in the corner. I'm going to try all of these on for you guys now, but I do have a discount code. The girls mentioned that they set me up a little discount code, which is exciting because they've actually never had a Sasuke discount code. I don't think ever, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, I'll chuck that on the screen. All right, I'm going to show you guys, as promised, the Sasuke sets. They are so nice, especially this material. It's like, it's just so buttery and feels really, really, really good. Super supportive as well. By the way, they had padding in these tops, but I actually took the padding out, but you guys can leave the padding in there if you would like. They do feel really supportive though. Like the band underneath is like thick enough and tight enough to like feel super supportive, if that makes sense. So that's good. I'm gonna show you guys in the mirror because it's probably like a little bit easier for you to see my pants. Ah! All right, so this is the set. His leggings are a really good length. Really good fit as well, by the way. I'm wearing extra small in everything. The bum is like a nice scrunch bum. So that's those. And then I did also get them in this short length as well, which I feel I would really like. Obviously, because it's winter, these ones are going to be so handy. And I'll just absolutely be living in these. But I do like wearing shorts as well. I feel like it's like super comfy to train in. And these ones are good, like, walking slash training length. I might just chuck them on for you guys. Wow. Yep. Okay. I love the length of these. Absolutely perfect length to train in. Waistband is super nice. It's, like, the same as the leggings that I just had on. It's, like, a nice, thick waistband. Hugs you in. Pretty sure that's actually a pocket. Wait. Let me check. Yeah, That's actually a pocket. So, it's the same as, like, some of their older ones that I used to wear heaps. Love, I love the color as well. It's a really nice, light, sandy sort of beige. I'm so impressed. I love getting new activewear and it actually like motivates me as well. So hopefully this does motivate me. Speaking of, I have been so shit the past week because I went to Bali and then I had a week at home and it was just like crazy busy. I only got home on the Tuesday, I think it was, and I just couldn't get into a routine all week. So I was just, I just felt like I was catching up the whole time, to be honest. And then I went and stayed with my sister and my mom for a little bit, um, just to see them for a couple of days because I hadn't seen them the past couple of months too much. But um, yeah, I just feel like I haven't been able to get in a good routine with training, which really sucks because when I was in Bali for that four weeks, I feel like I was like so motivated and I was like seeing changes and everything. So I feel like I have been a little bit slack on my training, but I definitely will get myself back into routine again because it makes me feel so all over the place when I'm not training. All right, next up is this little chocolate number. It feels exactly the same as the last set I showed you. Just like a really soft, nice buttery feel. The shorts are little booty shorts. I also got... oh. I actually got it in a blue color as well. I'm not going to try it on for you, but that color is so cute. I'm obsessed with that. I love this. This is a little jumper that I chose. You just slip your head through that little hole. It does come in another couple of colors, but perfect if you like wearing little crops like me. I love wearing crops, but obviously it is getting colder, so it's nice to have your arms in if you're going for a walk or whatever. All right, next up, this is from their new Seamless collection. So the last stuff I was wearing for you guys was from their Earth collection, I believe it was called. And then this is a seamless. This feels so good. This is actually the reason why I wanted to get some more of the Sasuke stuff. Just because I saw 
a couple of my friends wearing it and it looks so comfy and it actually is it's really really comfy so it has this like low v style bralette crop i would say i really like the length of these shorts like i feel like they're really good for walking slash also really good if you are working out that is the back of them okay last set i'm going to show you guys and please let's just ignore the mess going on in the background we really need to clean the kitchen uh so this is the last set and this is actually probably my favorite these leggings feel like absolutely incredible so this is the seamless again a different style top super flattering it's got the little brandy here and then the brandy on the back actually it feels quite thick but it's still lightweight if that makes sense like it feels thick when i'm going like that it's definitely double lined obviously to make sure it's not see-through but it doesn't feel too heavy if that makes sense I'll show you guys in the mirror as well so yeah i feel like this is my favorite anyway that is my little haul of the new sassy stuff that i got as promised i will leave my discount card on the screen in case you guys want to go and shop any of their little bits i'm actually going to finish this vlog off now because i want to get it edited and get it straight up to you guys i do also have another vlog coming out in two days from when this one is being uploaded so lots of vlogs coming like i said before i do have that discount code for emma sleep which is still valid so it's talia 5 which will give you five percent off their already discounted products which they're already like over half price so that is crazy i will leave that on the screen in case you guys wanted to go and check out their websites i love you all and i'll see you soon